I'm the Root Beer Guy, and today I'll be comparing the Zero Sugar versions of A&W, Barks, and Mug. When I compared the sugared varieties, my ranking was Barks number one, A&W second, and Mug third. Instead of high fructose corn syrup, these are sweetened with aspartame and asulsifame potassium, with the mug having sucralose also added into the mix. I will say I find aspartame to be a bit harsh of a sweetener, so I'm not sure what I'll think of these, but hopefully they'll be good. Let's begin with the A&W. There's some nice vanilliness to start, like the original, but it's soured somewhat by that artificial sweetener taste later on. The flavors feel like they're fighting each other. Next, the Barks. This works a bit better than the A&W for me. There's spiciness to it, though reduced from its full sugar brother, and while there is still a turn from that sweetener, it's less dramatic than the A&W. Finally, the mug. It's a fairly balanced taste, with the root beer flavor pairing better with that artificial sweetener. It still has a sour turn, but it's the least of the three. Mug is my top pick here. It takes the smallest swing with its flavor, but that means it can focus on that base root beer in its taste. The A and W and Barks try to taste like their full sugar compatriots, but lose themselves a bit too much in the process. The Mug is my favorite of the three, with Barks being number two, and A and W with the bronze.